Welcome to MMA vs. Stemma Real Sparring Video. The first half is real MMA sparring, including against pro fighters and a champion MMA fighter in Japan, as well as a lot of bare knuckle sparring type training. I hope you guys will enjoy it. There I am intercepting his intention with cross face biomechanics against that pro pancreas fighter there. Another punch, cross face, defending takedown defense there. Isn't that interesting? Guys, I've been doing martial arts like 34 years. And, uh, well, I've been exposed to Sistema for about 20 of those last years. Oh, look at that inside knife t defense to the throat chop. Wasn't that at the end subway fight in John Wick 2? And kneeling down on the knees against a shorter Asian fighter. Didn't we see that? Almost shot for shot exactly at the end of John Wick 3 as I filmed there with a shorter Malaysian guy in 2014. Here I am doing the flying squirrel defense people said would never, ever work from Sistema against a standing guillotine choke by a bigger heavyweight Mima champion, heavyweight fighter, purple belt in jiu-jitsu. Knows how to do guillotine chokes. Yes, yes, I did. So you can too. Be open-minded, my friends. Try and learn a little bit. Uh, here I am in Mok Sakurai, Maha Sakurai's dojo in Tokyo, Japan. and. Uh, just watch the video and stay tuned, guys, and I think you'll like the bare knuckle stuff as well. So, guys, I got exposed to Sistema in 98 or 99 in a back alley after JKD training from George Pogasic. George S. Pogasic. George Pogasic. Look him up on YouTube and subscribe to his channels. He is amazing. He's the last guy I'd want to fight in a dark alley or to the death. So. Sistema is like a master class or PhD program to someone that already has their bachelor's. And you're talking to people that have been even graduated high school. Not everyone in Sistema can fight. A lot of the videos look silly, even from the great guys. And certainly a lot of the videos from a lot of people look bad from the bad guys. They're not very good. And if you haven't trained in it, if you haven't experienced it, if you can't learn from videos, visual learner like I am, you probably can't tell the difference i know it's difficult i have never said otherwise but um be open-minded take what is useful and uh hopefully you can learn some things from this video here i am against going against the former pancreas champion former pancreas champion suzuki look at me hitting from the outside of the peripheral vision look at me hitting on the inside multiple hits with one arm things of that nature Why are you going to listen to them? Why are you going to listen to anonymous people? They Did they fight pro? No. Did they train with the top pros around the world for 20 plus years like I did? The top pro fighters? The best instructors? No. Did they actually spar for off and on for over 20 years? No. Have they been in multiple opponent fights multiple times? No. Have they defended themselves against weapons before? No. So their opinions shouldn't matter. People badmouth because it's a lot of it's showing slow, whatever, but people cannot even replicate the instinctiveness with the precision and the biomechanics that the, the top people have. Like, not even. All the badmouthers, okay, duplicate that. See if you could duplicate that. He didn't do it choreographed. We'll let you do it choreographed. Let's see if you can duplicate the precision choreographed. They couldn't do it. Just think about the precision. Okay. I'll think about that they can hit loose, hit deep, hit hard, hit non-telegraphic. Haven't we seen cookie-cutter MMA fighters only focus on physical attributes? Strength, steroids, speed, endurance, EPO. Uh, that's not going to be lasting you when you're 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 years old. That's not going to last you when you have horrible diseases like I do, but even though I wasn't the most athletic guy, even though I was very short compared to a lot of the guys, I, I, I really like sparred he heavy MMA sparring with over the years. How do I do that? Distance control and sensing intention, stealing intention, higher level concepts that not all of you are going to get, but I hope this video helps explain some of it to you. Here I am at uh, Korean Zombies Gym in Seoul, Korea. And uh, I'm playing with some cage of dope. 
Very interesting. Didn't we see a bit more cage of dope from Anderson Silva after this fight? After I after this video came out? The video where I'm in Korea doing this here? Looseness. Non-telegraphic. Unusual angles. Was people that excel. You're gonna see loose movement and you're gonna see less telegraphing from the old days of all this strong power hooks with the telegraphing shoulders and all of that. Uh, guys, Sistema is like a master class for the experienced martial artists. It's like a PhD program for someone that already has their bachelor's. Will most beginners get a lot out of it? No. Are there a lot of videos out there from people that have horrible balance and just are not very good martial artists? Yes. Um, does a lot of what I do look different? Yes. But except for the haters and people hate what they don't know, what they can't understand, what's different. How it can teach you line formalization to pick up things from strange angles, throw from strange angles, throw um, from outside the peripheral vision, intercept up the straight the center. I got a little too much uh, um, pressure in my body or whatever. I'd like to see them spar. I'd like to see them spar. They can't even go at this level, which some of you think is too light. There is ways of hiding strikes, even straight punches going from underneath the upward angle, uh, outside in, like long hooks, like Fade War. Knocked a lot of dudes out with. He also had the nastiest ground a pound in Pride. Didn't Fedor whip outside the peripheral vision like I teach in my videos, how to do Russian long hooks like Fedor Milianenko? The video, guys, you might want to watch. Guys, if you like Sistema, if you're interested more, um, if there's even more to it about that really applies to self-defense from angles from the side, from rolling off sucker punches with your shoulders, as you see me do here. Sometimes I get two sideways. That's on purpose. That's the practice. Sistema breaking structure. KGB takedowns that should get you. And that's especially interesting um, um, to maybe older judoka and Aikido people. You'll see a lot of Kazushi there and about the body and the spine. Some of it's hard to explain if you haven't trained your whole life. This is just language to me since um, that's what I've done my entire life. So uh, I hope you guys like this video. So yes, a lot is, you do see I mix in a lot of deflections and forearm blocks and, and things of that nature. Some of it kind of looks like what the Diaz brothers even train. A little slap boxing bare knuckle, doesn't it? Some of it looks like some stuff Yo Romero has messed people up. Some of it looks like stuff Anderson Silva has done at times, doesn't it? Martial arts is martial arts. Stop being so worried about that style sucks. And this worry about you and how good you can get and take what is useful. Um, I have been to a a, a seminar, Vasily of seminar, a couple days, and there was like a hundred people there. Yes, ninety people there were delusional. They couldn't fight their way out of a paper bag. Um, but there are ten people there, including older, which is important. And some probably had backgrounds in martial arts, just like George did, just like Vladimir himself did. Um, those people had something real. I think they could adequately defend themselves. There are um, being instinctual and loose when you're surprised is a very good thing. I was working at a gun store and suddenly I was talking to one customer and suddenly I just noticed to my right, a gun was pointed right at me. All of a sudden, someone had just walked up and pulled out a gun and pointed it right at me. It wasn't a Krav Maga thing. I instinctively snatched it, got off the center, and just ripped it. Just an instinctual quick snatch. Like you see a lot of the stuff I do in these videos. Um, I just snatched it right out of their hands. Um, this is for when you're jumped in transitional spaces. The way real attacks happen, guys. From the sides, behind a car, hiding behind a bush, the corner of a wall. Um, just standing on the corner and then they jump you. You like 
there's a video back in the day, people think I'm acting where he slaps me in the stomach from a few inches away or smacks my arm, chops my arm from a few inches away. I am in horrible, agonizing pain down on my knees. That's legit. No, I don't think I'm the best. Never said I was the best MMA fighter, best fighter, anything like that. But I all right in all ranges of combat in all kinds of different ways. And, uh, you know, always try to explain people, look outside the box, pick up what's useful. And I'm trying to show you some things. And yes, this is a beginner here, but I just did up one armed arm fold takedown into an arm bar. The training like this, even soft, boy, that can be helpful when you've bounced like I have, when you've fought multiple opponents like I have, faced against weapons like I have, for real. So, um, I hope this will just enlighten your eyes a little bit. Um, I think more people probably get more out of Sistema, especially nowadays. Maybe in the 90s it was a little different, but especially nowadays, if you had a large background, physical background before you were 40, where you were doing combat sambo, where you were doing judo, where you were doing all the hard styles, I think you'll get more out of it. Even Vasilia was a very experienced karate guy. Unless you're a guy like Robko who was trained since early childhood by one of Stalin's bodyguards. Or unless if you're in charge of the USSR's ballistic missile, missile, interballistic missiles, entire program during the Cold War. Pretty important. You're a physicist, literally a rocket scientist, a pretty smart guy in Kato, Kato that could, um, you know, understand biomechanics and physics. So, no matter what martial arts, shouldn't you try to take that and, and become better? Apply it?